Now, unfortunately, well, maybe even fortunately, maybe there are some physicians uh, with us uh, joining us on this broadcast today, but probably the majority of you are, are caregivers or patients or others. What I do as the surgeon and physician for a patient, whenever I come in with any kind of report, and Rob alluded to this, when I come in with a PATH report that may have some bad news in it, what do I do? I emphasize the good news. I come in always optimistic. I come in trying to be as upbeat as I can because as you're suggesting, there's more good news just around the corner with the kind of research that's going on. And if let me say this finally on this subject, if those of you who are watching are not working with uh, physicians and others who are not emphasizing the good news, find somebody else to work with because there's a lot to be encouraged about and I want to urge all of us caregivers, if you will, in the sense of giving care to please act positive because we have a right to do that and a lot of optimism. You know, can I just jump in here because for everybody who's watching this, one of the first things that Dr. Harness had told me when he would call me and say, okay, Lise, where are you at now? And first thing he told me was get a hold of my medical records because it's really important. Let's say exactly that you're not happy with this physician or it's doom and gloom and you think, oh, this is it. That, you know, that whole do as I say, not as I do. It's okay to find another doctor. And I think that that's really important. And Dr. Harness, you may want to jump in. And it's definitely okay to get a second opinion and maybe even a third or a fourth and get a copy of that report and just see what the other input is from those other doctors. Yes, yeah, Dr. That, yeah that's absolutely correct, uh, Lisa. And you, you know I'm a big advocate of that. I'm a big advocate of multidisciplinary care. I'm a big advocate of having a navigator to help guide you through the process. But the point of the question, I think, is a fantastic question. We want to constantly encourage people, almost no matter what stage of their disease they're at, because I'm optimistic about what's just around the corner and the progress we're making right now. Hi, I'm Dr. Jay Harness, and I want to share with you important information that I believe that every newly diagnosed patient with breast cancer needs to know. I'm a breast cancer survivor. I am a breast cancer survivor. I am a breast cancer survivor. And I want every woman to know about personalized breast cancer treatment and the genomic test. A test that helps guide a woman and her doctor to the best treatment options for her. Pass it on. 